doing well? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. That's nice. Uh, they say whenever I get an opportunity in comedy that I'm getting it because I'm a woman, which is strange. Well, if that bothers you so much, get a sex operation and join us. <laughs> I know what the problem is. Yeah. They also say that women aren't funny. You see, we're just trying to fit in. <laughs> so, that's all we're doing. Yeah. And also, I want to reserve my right to mediocrity. I was an engineer once, and I was a bad one. I was like one of those bad Indian Idol contestants, you know? <laughs> that got booed off stage for singing, Aashik Banaya. Aashik Banaya. Yeah. But so were the boys and my peers, all right? They were pretty bad too. But they still got by because, you know, they were sleeping with the bosses. <laughs> so obviously, the company put them together because, you know, what works well together? <laughs> mediocrity. <laughs> because the thing about mediocrity is it always works in groups. <laughs> yes, it does. Think about any corporation, or if you're a younger demographic, One Direction. <laughs> what comedy is going to do for women is that it's going to tell you the truth. You know what the truth is? That women can be sick in human people too. <laughs> the reason there are less female murderers and psychopaths in the world is because we're too oppressed to show our true colors. <laughs> yeah. You know, a lot of people think that whatever we do as women, we do it with passion. That's not true anymore because a lot of things I do are because I can. Like, I would be Sundar Pichai if I could. <laughs> I would. But I'm not that talented, so now I'm doing comedy. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. You know, I wish I knew I was going to be a comedian back in the day. Because every time a teacher yelled at me, like, why are you playing the fool all the time? Are you going to be a clown all your life? I would say, yes. <laughs> yes, I am. So, is this being a clown going to pay your bills? If I keep at it long enough, <laughs> it might just pay my bills. You know, there's a, a lot of chatter about women not being inherently funny. Like a man called Christopher Hitchens wrote an essay about how women aren't inherently funny because we don't need humor to impress men. <laughs> But we still need humor to get by. Also, give us a hundred years and we'll condition you into thinking we're funny. <laughs> yeah. I mean, women have extremely grim lives and sense of humor, right? That's because we lead very grim lives. That's why we have a grim sense of humor. Like, think about, think about the social issues men have to face, right? Like gold diggers. They're hilarious. A woman tricking a man into marrying her just for the money, that's funny. <laughs> However, when women talk about social issues, it has to be something like one time a man threw acid on my face. <laughs> yeah, they say a lot of comedy is derived from tragedy, right? There's nothing more tragic than women's lives around the world. And the nature scam that for the world to move on, Men and women have to get along. <laughs> That's my set, everyone. Thank you very much. Hi, I'm Nivedita, and my set was inspired by the Prime original, the marvelous Mrs. Maisel, the marvelous Mrs. Maisel, the marvelous Mrs. Maisel. You can now stream the new season only on Amazon Prime Video. Amazon Prime Video. So 